You talk and get paid. I spread the news. It's a classic win-win. I'm working on an investigative piece about some of the businesses in the well right now. Trying to get a handle on how things are in that part of the city. I'm not sure the story will get off the ground, though. <clears throat> I asked the higher-ups if I could go down there for some interviews, but they said it's too dangerous. It'd probably be all for it if David asked. Would you really? I'd owe you big time if you did. You've been a huge help on my other stories. I'm sure you'd do great. Great. I had three interviewees in mind. Teresa Mason, the owner of Kay's house, Henrik Zaran at Apex Electronics, and Nurse O'Shea from the Med Bay. You don't need to ask too many tough questions. I just want to read on how their businesses are doing, and how things are in the well. I really can't thank you enough. Understand? Absolutely. I'm sure my mom would be proud to have the place featured in an article. What's up? Business is steady, as usual. We don't tolerate violence or disrespect. So a lot of folks like to spend time here. The only thing that's worrying me is a new group of customers I've seen hanging around lately. They've been watching the UC Surplus store pretty closely. I have a bad feeling they might be planning something. Kay's house has a reputation as a safe place. I don't want to be associated with that kind of thing. Honestly, I'd really appreciate that. I'd feel terrible if something happened and I hadn't done anything to try to stop it. Why don't you come by when you have some spare time? And we'll talk it out. <sighs> Same as ever. I've lived in the well my whole life and things have never really changed. The UC government promises to clean the place up every couple years, but there's still just as much crime and poverty as there was when I was a kid. That's why Kay's house is so important. It's the one place people in the well feel safe. Be sure to put that in the article, okay? I'm really proud of it. Yeah, sure thing. I'm Teresa Mason, and this is my home. My mom's the Kay who founded Kay's house. I grew up here along with the business. My mom passed the place on to me when she decided to retire. Running it is my pride and joy. I've put everything I have into it. Great. Let me know when the article comes out, will you? I'd like to read it. I've got limited resources. We're doing the best we can here. That's all we can ever do. A journalist? That's a surprise. Most people don't think anything that goes on in the well is worth writing about. I'd be happy to help if I can. Things are always rough at the Med Bay. I'm the closest thing to a doctor that the well has, and I can't treat everyone. The last few weeks have been especially bad. There's some kind of infection going around. And a lot of kids down here are catching it. It just breaks my heart to see. Oh, you're sweet to offer. There might be something you can do, if you're willing. Let's chat again when you have some time to spare, all right? 
Sure, if you'd like. My name's Talia. I was born and raised right here in the well. I've been the nurse here at the med bay for over a decade now. Once upon a time, I was a combat medic for the UC Navy. When the colony war ended, I came back to the well to put my skills to use for the people here. Things are always the same in the well. Violent and dangerous. I swear I treat more injuries here than I did when I was a Navy medic. All right, dear. You let me know if there's anything else I can do for you. Can't say I'll have what you need, but you're welcome to look. A reporter? Fine, but I'm only talking basics. I don't like people snooping around my business. Door still open, isn't it? That's my idea of success. Sorry if you were hoping for something more flowery. Great! Now why don't you help me out and buy something? I scratch your back, you scratch mine. My source is back. Here to report anything else? Hey, that's great. Thanks so much. Did everything go all right? That's why stories like this one are so important. If people knew what was going on down there, maybe they'd want to help fix it. I can't thank you enough for helping me out. I'll send you a copy of the story if it gets published. <laughs> There's nothing like seeing your name in print. Back to the grind. 